Okay, I'm just now realizing that this is going to be my third video in a row about the ugly ass Paul Brothers. I am sorry, but they are just so problematic, I can't help it. Anyways, if you haven't heard, a video was recently leaked of Jake Paul rapping a song. But it wasn't just any ordinary song, you know? No. This song just so happened to have the N-word in it. Twice. And Jake Paul's dumbass thought it would be a good idea not only to sing both the N-words, but also have his friend record it. If you haven't seen the clip, I'll leave a link to it in the description because I'm not trying to get copyrighted again because I uploaded the clip in my last video and bitch, literally the song that he was singing got me copyrighted and I'm like, Phew. I'm about to fight YouTube. Now it isn't even like he wasn't aware that he was being recorded. At the very beginning of the video, he literally looks directly at the camera like, how fucking stupid are you? I do want to make it clear that this video was recorded like a year or two ago, but that doesn't make it okay. Even if this was recorded five years ago, that still would make it wrong. Like, I honestly don't get how people say like, oh, that was like, that was like 10 years ago. It was five years ago. It was blank, blank years ago, blah, blah, blah. It's like, it doesn't matter how long ago it was. It matters that you said it in any point in time. Like, like I get that people can change over time, which is great. But like I said in all my videos, forgive, don't forget. To be honest, though, I'm not surprised that this has happened. Like, at all especially since i found these tweets while doing research for this video they may be fake but just in case they aren't i want to include them in If those tweets are in fact real, not only has he used the n-word many times in the past, but he's also homophobic, which does not pass in my book because, if you haven't picked up on it, I'm gay as fuck. I personally think that we all need to just like step back, you know, relax, take a drink, and leave Logan and Jake in 2017. Like, it isn't too late, we can still return them back to YouTube, I mean, I still have the receipts if you guys want them. I don't really see how anyone could find Jake Paul entertaining or funny. With Logan, I can at least say that when he isn't being an inconsistent asshole, like he was in his like Japan Forest vlog, some of his videos are cool. Like I can admit that. I don't watch him a lot, but I have seen a few of his videos in the past. But Jake Paul, he's always been bad. Like even before his controversies in Everyday Bro, he was just awful. And between us, I heard his nudes got leaked, but I'm not sure if they were confirmed to be his or not, but that's the tea. But anyways, this is probably going to end up being a really short video since there isn't really much to say, but moral of the story is, both Logan Paul and Jake Paul are terrible human beings, but Logan's like 0.2% better than Jake, and they will both use us for views and money. But anyways, today's shout out goes to Kaylee Bones. I'm so sorry if I said your name wrong, like, I'm so bad with names, it's ridiculous, but thank you for watching me and supporting my videos. If you guys want a shout out too, all you have to do is turn on my post notifications and comment in the first, like, hour or two. I'm, like, really active in the comments, like, the first hour or two. So, like, if I see a comment, and if, I, if I see you, like, showing love or just being funny, I don't know, I'll probably pick you. I don't know, it's really random who I pick, but but anyways, that's all for me for now. I'll see you bitches in the next video. Bye.